Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is a little kind of tutorial on how to edit .mov QuickTime file formats on Sony Vegas 8 or 9 or 10. Um, currently the codecs, codecs that are with Sony Vegas don't allow you to edit .mov formats. When you bring up the file, I can show you now, you bring up, open the file you wish to edit and what will happen is, you can see here along the bottom, I'm pointing, but you can't, <laughs> I use a mouse, um, you can't actually get the audio track, which is obviously not very helpful when you go to play it back, and you can't hear anything, so it's not helpful at all when you try to edit, and then, you know, you have to record in a separate way, not helpful. Um, but I've managed to find a way to edit your files, so you can instantly edit them on Sony Vegas. So you're going to jump back into the folder where you have your files. Now what you need to do is when you click on the file as it is, it comes up a quick time movie down the bottom here. Okay? Um, so the file sorry, the folder where you have the files you want to use, what you need to do is go to organize folder and search op options. You may want to watch this in 1080p um, so you can actually see this quite detailed because it's quite a high bit rate. Um, when you're in the folder options you go to view and then you can have the little details here and it will say hide extensions for known file types. Untick that box and then click apply and then click OK. Okay. Now what comes up now is you've got your file and then .mov then if you rename it so either right click and rename or We'll just go on it and then press F2. The .mov you need to change to MP4 or any other file format you wish that Sony Vegas can read correctly with audio levels and things like that. So once you've got that, then you just click off and then it will come like this. If you change the file name extension, it might become unusable. Are you sure you want to change it? Make sure you've got a backup of it before you do this, just in case. So yes, and it will come up here to MP4. Now if you note down the information, it's now been changed to MP4 video. And you've still got all the same information, same bit rate and same size of the file. So now going to Sony Vegas, currently using Sony Vegas 9. And then open. Now try and open your folder again, your file, sorry. Now it will come up building peaks. And finally, you have the audio level. So now, it's not the kind of leaflet you can open up and get more instructions from. Um, there's a little protection cover on the dot connector part. You've got the, as you can hear there, you've got the sounds of your video. I've been looking on a way to try and do this, trying different codecs for ages, and it just hasn't worked. And just a simple solution that means I can finally edit my videos is just are oh, such a big deal to me to be able to put even just the dissolve on the start and the end of the video makes such a big difference to how I like to present videos and makes it look more professional so I hope this is a help <laughs> I hope this has been some help to you and that you can use this in your own videos I'm certainly really pleased about this so you can, you can add dissolves into the start so when you go at the start it goes black it goes and fades in oh I love it so yeah, thanks for watching the video, hopefully it's been some use to you, and I will see you in the next video. Thank you guys for watching, and keep watching for some more edited footage. Cheers guys, bye.